I'm here with uh, Lee Evans from MDA after his uh, straight sets win over Sandra Eric Sosing at Ali Pali. Lee, um, how much did you know about today's opponent and could you do really anything to prepare any differently for him? Um, absolutely nothing that I knew about him, apart from maybe he was the, the Asian qualifier. But the preparation is the same with everyone, really. Like I don't change my preparation. It was stay on my own, just make sure I'm in the 60s, which I didn't actually do on stage half the time, but I just I try, try doing the same thing, make sure I'm in my favourite doubles in practice and stuff, and then just go from there, really. And how was the uh, the experience of the walk-on and the uh, the stage and the, the surroundings? Is it different to anywhere you've ever played? I must admit, like, I've, I've gone to European tours, got the UK Open, I've just done that here, and I don't even know if I'm coming on, to be fair. I don't hear the I don't hear the, the calling, I don't hear the walk-on music, I don't even hear the... Um, like the people screaming, I just go up there, yeah, I notice this guy on the walk on, I know this guy over here, I always say hello to this one, and that's about it, I don't even really take much notice of everything else, I just concentrate on myself really. And after losing the opening leg, uh, you breeze to the next six to take a 2-0 lead, Did you were, you were you sort of at threat from getting a bit embroiled during the uh, the third set, or did, did you see yourself just having it all in hand? It was just one of them, what, even, like the first leg when... I just thought, yeah, that's a warm-up for me. I knew I didn't throw well in that one, but I think I might have hit a 13 dire or something, second leg or third leg, and that settled me down very easily. I just cruised through the rest, really. It was um, the last set. Um, obviously, being two each or two one down, I still didn't panic. I just thought, if I play my game, I'm going to win this. But if I could just struggle through it, which I, I did, actually. I did struggle through it quite a bit, but... I was always comfortable trying to win it. So. And next up, it's uh, Luke Humphreys, which you know is obviously the man of the moment at the minute. Um, but your ex-county teammates, and you know him very well as, as doubles partners, do you go into that sort of as you know freewheeling and a free hit, or you know do you go in it with you know you're playing to win and you you know you're confident of getting the the result? It will be a free hit in one way, but this is one of them ones where I'm, I'll be comfortable playing him. He plays a good good pace of darts whereas I'm a bit more methodical maybe but I can play quick but I'll just do what I do every time and it's it'd be interesting game to be fair because who better to be his, lose, uh, be his winning streak at the moment to be fair <laughs> <laughs> and, and obviously you take confidence from the Pro Tour this year you've beaten you know the likes of Michael Van Gerwen, Chis and Alright and loads of others Will that, will that play into your mind? I mean, you've played Luke once on the floor this season. Will, yep. will that have any bearing tomorrow? Is it a completely different... Completely different game tomorrow. Even, like, even the games with Van Gogh and Chizzy and everyone else like that. Like, I think I've played my, some of my worst games and I've actually beat them. Like, I've played so many great games and lost games to people that you like nowhere near as high calibre as them. But we, I played Luke a couple of months ago it was a tight well not a tight game but it was a nervous game it was a strange game really but hopefully it'll be like that again and if I pick my game up I can cause an upset tomorrow and finally it'll be last game on tomorrow so your first game on today are you expecting sort of a, a different atmosphere tomorrow with you know it being so late on um, well I like the atmosphere today to be fair I thought it was a good atmosphere today but I always enjoy playing later on at night later on at night it suits me It'll probably suit him as well. Um, I enjoy the like taking his time in the day and then coming up reasonably early on just to get a bit of practicing really. But yeah, may the best man win for that one. That would be good. Brilliant. Best of luck, Lee. Thank you.